You can't talk about the neighborhood of Four Corners without a bit of information about the area of Four Corners. Near the intersection of US 27 and 192, or Earlo Bronson Memorial Highway, is the area named after the four counties that intersect at this point, Polk, Lake, Osceola, and Orange County. The Four Corners area is a rapidly growing community that is home to a number of residential developments, vacation homes, and resorts. If you've driven down US 27, you've seen all the construction and new communities going up in what feels like overnight. A few short miles south of the intersection of 27 and 192 is the neighborhood of Four Corners. It's located in Davenport, which is a part of Polk County. Four Corners has 346 single-family homes. They are single-story and two-story homes. Construction in Four Corners started in early 2001 and finished up in 2006. There are a couple of newer homes in the mix as well. The homes range in size from 1,517 square feet all the way up to 3,245 square feet. They are three bedrooms up to six bedrooms and some have as many as four and a half bathrooms. All of the homes have attached two car garages and many of them have swimming pools. This community allows full-time residents, vacation homes, long-term and short-term rental homes. The minimum rental length is one week. The majority of the communities in Davenport allow for short-term rentals, but if you're looking for an investment property, you do have to be careful because there are quite a few communities that are strictly residents only and do not allow for short-term rental. The HOA, or Homeowners Association fee, is a low $660 a year. That's around $55 a month, plus there is no CDD, so no additional expense on your taxes for the community development. One of the main attractions in the area is nearby Walt Disney World Resort, which is located just a few miles northeast of Four Corners. It's about a 15 to 20 minute drive and you'll be on Disney property. Other popular theme parks are Universal Studios, SeaWorld, and Legoland. And even Busch Gardens is a short drive from this area of Central Florida. In addition to its proximity to theme parks and tourist attractions, Four Corners offers a variety of outdoor recreational activities, including golfing, hiking, fishing, and boating. The area is also known for its numerous shopping and dining options, including outlet malls and restaurants. Northeast Regional Park is just down the road with all their outdoor activities and dog parks you can imagine. Location is always important. The community of Four Corners is across the street from the brand new Publix. So you have a Publix across the street with some additional shops and about a mile away you have a second Publix and about three miles the opposite direction you can find Posner Park with all of its shopping. So as far as location goes you can't beat the convenience for your groceries or everyday shopping. Four Corners is a very nice neighborhood, and as you can see by driving through how well kept the yards are, obviously it's pickup day and there are some yard scraps out front, but that's only because they're being picked up today. But overall, you see very clean homes, the yards look wonderful, and as you can tell as I'm driving through, you're not weaving in and out of cars parked along the street. For me, that's a bonus with the neighborhood and makes it so much easier to navigate them. While the area of Four Corners has a bunch of outdoor activities for everyone, 
The community of Four Corners also has its own activities. They have a beautiful swimming pool, a basketball court, and a play area for kids with a wonderful play structure. We are going to take a moment and take a tour through one of the homes in Four Corners. This home was built in 2002 and is 2,531 square feet. It's a five bedroom, three and a half bath home, and there's a pool with the cage over top in back. What I love about this home are these wonderful high ceilings. You have this wonderful size kitchen area that leads straight into the breakfast nook. Accessing the patio is through the sliding glass door in both the breakfast nook and the main living space. There is a third access point from the master bedroom with its own sitting area. The nice sized walk-in closet is found within the ensuite bathroom. The large lanai by the pool makes for the perfect spot for enjoying your morning coffee. Once you're upstairs, you really get to take in how beautiful these cathedral ceilings are throughout the home. There's an additional two full bathrooms in the upstairs. One is a Jack and Jill bathroom, while the second is your traditional full bath. This has been Roxy Stover Bittner with Keller Williams Realty at the Lakes. I would appreciate it if you would hit the like button. And if you'd like to see more great properties, and neighborhood tours, go ahead and follow me. I'm leading the way to those tours.